Hi everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, we will be learning about uh, one of the reports <clears throat> where uh, a researcher can be able to bypass the biometric security functionality in a Shopify mobile application. So the summary is uh, when Shopify Android application has an option to sign in to the uh, application using fingerprint, this is the functionality which is affected, uh, which is signing into the application using fingerprint. But if the application was open and someone triggers a deep link, authentication is no longer required. So basically what, is, what the researcher is saying that whenever user uh, enabled this particular sign into the application using fingerprint, it is there. Uh, someone has to uh, log in through fingerprint only on uh, then and then the application will allow to log in. But <clears throat> in such cases where uh, deep link is called or uh, the application is open through a different medium, right? So at that point of time, the authentication is not required. So here is a proof of concept of video. <clears throat> POC video is here. And let's see that. So first of all, uh, researcher is showing the version which he is using. Then logging into the Shopify application. Once he is logged in, going to the settings and enabling the fingerprint for the authentication. Now, when, uh, when the researcher is opening the application, the sign in is there. Okay, so fingerprint authentication is there. Now the user is going to Shopify help center where uh, the links uh, are there uh, which when you click on this particular link it will directly uh, open the Shopify app. So here as it is uh, the split screen is there and uh, when someone clicks on the link it just bypasses the fingerprint authentication. And it is no longer required one can be able to access the application one can see the orders and products stores okay so this is a really easy vulnerability to find right? the impact will be low because uh, the attacker will require the physical access of particular device uh, of that particular uh, you can say Shopify which enables uh, which has those uh, Shopify application installed on that so the impact will be really low but uh, it is still a vulnerability so thank you for watching the video stay tuned for the next one